Howdy folks, today we're looking at the Fiskars 36 inch long handled swivel grass shears, which is a real fancy way of saying scissors on a stick. These things were uh, 20 bucks on Amazon. Uh, I got them looking for a way to keep the raised beds clean without uh, using a weed whacker and sending cuttings all over the place and destroying the irrigation system like I uh, tend to do every time I hop up there with the weed whacker. So the build quality on these things is so-so. They're light and generally feel good in the hand. The mechanism's smooth, but it feels kind of cheap and it jams easily on twigs and rocks and mulch and stuff like that. Uh, it tends to kind of get caught between the blades. They're, they're not really held precision close together. It's a, it, it's a loose mechanism that I think is designed that way to... Uh, you know, be a little more resilient to the abuse it's going to take, but it does make them jam easier. Uh, like uh, like a lot of tools, the handle's a little too short for me, so I get the same lower back pain I get with uh, every handheld tool designed for uh, normal people. Uh, my other big complaint is the blades don't open very far, so you can't cut very much at once. I think this is probably deliberate to keep you from overloading the mechanism, uh, but you know, like most tools today, I would rather pay, you know, five times as much and get something that really worked and would last a lifetime instead of getting cheap crap designed to, you know, not work all that well to preserve itself. But there aren't a lot of options for things like that these days unless you make it yourself. Uh, let's see, what do I like about it? I like the rotating head, which allows, uh, you know, allows you to use it from either up in the garden bed or down below. And in particular, I like that it, uh, you can rotate the head at any angle. It doesn't only work at the uh, 90 degree intervals. That's pretty cool. And then lastly, uh, you can see it's got a bit of a safety lock little deal on here just to hold it closed, which, you know, I, I don't know if it's really important, but, you know, it's nice that it can uh, hold itself closed in a, a slightly safer fashion. So overall, I'd give this maybe a three out of five. It does the job slowly. I'm not really convinced that they're going to last all that long. So yeah, that's about what I've got today. If you've been uh, looking at these, considering picking up a pair, uh, don't uh, set your expectations too high, but it looks like they uh, will do the job, and hey, they're 20 bucks. So yeah, uh, till next time around, and uh, hopefully we'll go into something a little more interesting than a uh, review of garden shares. Yeah, all right, till then, bye-bye.